Okay, hello! Welcome back to our online class, students! Again, this is Teacher M. Okay, so today, we'll be having speaking activity. As always, we have speaking activity in my class. So, for today, our topic is about project, a uh, subject pronoun and object pronoun. Okay? So class, what do you mean by subject pronouns? Subject pronouns are those pronouns that perform the action in a sentence, okay? So they are I, you, he, he refers to one boy, right? Or one man, she, one girl or one woman, we, including ourselves, more than one, including ourselves, and they, uh, we are not included. Okay, plural too. Okay, now, uh, subject pronouns come before the verb in a sentence, except in questions. Okay, let's we have very example. I give them cookies every week. Okay, I. I is the subject pronoun. Okay, this one, I, I give them cookies every week. Okay, now, object pronouns are those pronouns that receive the action in a sentence. They are me, you, him, her, us, and them. Okay, and it can also be used after the verbs or preposition. Okay, example. I will go with him, okay? This one, him, we use it, him, okay? Used after the verb. What is the verb here? Go or preposition. This one, preposition with, right? So, we have him as object pronoun. Oh, teacher, it's hard. Now, it's easy. I will give you the technique, okay? Okay, class, don't forget, this is the technique. So, don't forget that subject pronouns are on the left side or before the verbs or prepositions except question, okay? What are the verbs here? Example of verbs, go, sing, play, write, write, read, talk, swim, cry, buy, and so on. We have a lot of verbs. Verbs or prepositions. Prepositions examples are here. Among, after, at, except, for, between, until, of, like, near, with, and so on. We have also a lot of example of prepositions. Okay? So, I, you, he, she, it, we, they, on the left. Me, you, him, her, it, us them on the right okay easy okay class we have your example you have to choose the correct answer from the parentheses okay number one here you shouldn't have done this too what is the missing word is it subject pronoun or object pronoun subject i object me. What do you think? Yes, me. We have already here, we have subject and we are looking for object. Subject, object, subject, object. Okay, subject on the left, object on the right. Don't forget. Number two, where could blank have gone a this hour of the night? Her or she? This is a question, class. Remember, uh, a while ago, I said that the subject pronoun is before the verb or preposition, right? And uh, object pronoun is after the verb or preposition, except for the question. Okay, so now class, do you think we are looking for 
subject or object pronoun. Okay, answer is subject pronoun. And what is the subject? Her or she? She, okay. He took, number three, he took blank with blank. They, them, him, he. Okay, what is the answer? This one is already subject. And we're looking for what? Object. Pronoun. Again, object pronoun, they or them. Of course, them with him or he. Okay, him. Number four. What is blank doing there? She or her. Again, this is a question uh, like, like this. There are different questions. Okay, the missing is subject, she, subject pronoun, she. What is she doing there? And last example, I, I saw you and blank there, she or her. Subject pronoun, object pronoun. The missing is object pronoun, her. Okay. We have already subject and this is object pronoun. Okay, now in class for your speaking test, I want you to fill in the blanks first and then say the statements with answer. Okay, don't forget to record your voice while reading your work. Okay, so for example, Fill in the blanks and read it. We have here number one. He lives with Jennifer. We are going to change uh, this name into pronoun. So what do you think? Uh, subject pronoun or object pronoun? He lives with... With what? He lives with... She or her? Yes, her because we only... We already have subject and we're looking for object pronoun. Okay, number two. The hockey players have a game tonight. Okay, this one. We're going to change it into pronoun. Subject or object. Blank have a game tonight. So they are more than one people. Because player has S, players. So we're going to use subject pronoun. And what is the subject pronoun that is missing here? They. Okay. So finished, right? Finished. Now read it. Okay. You're going to read this only. Okay. And this one. Okay, for example, you don't forget to say your name, na. For example, I'm Emerlyn Singson. I'm number 31. Number one, he lives with her. Number two, they have a game tonight. Number three, four, five. Okay, so this is your egg. Okay, class, for your speaking test, I want you to fill in the blanks and read the statements with answers. Okay, we have here five statements. Okay, five statements. I want you to fill in first. What is the missing pronoun here, number one? You have to change the word movie into pronoun. Okay, what is the pronoun of this? And is it subject or object pronoun? Okay, this is on the right. So what do you think? Hmm, easy. Okay. So class, I want you to change number two, Jane and I. Number three, the computer. Number four, Sarah. Number five, the children. Okay, the children are many. So it's plural. What would you 
say here? Okay, what is the answer here? Okay, don't forget again, subject pronouns are on the left, object pronouns are on the right. Okay, so don't read this class. Don't say this one. Okay, don't say that. Don't say this and this one. Only with check. Okay, just say these statements with check. Oh, Jamaica, do you understand? Okay, for example, number one, Thomas likes what? Number two, blank are friends. Number three, blank is broken. Number four, he will talk to blank later today. Number five, blank play in the park every day. That's it. Okay. So class, if you have questions, you can just ask teacher M in our group chats. Okay, don't be shy to ask teacher M and I will be asking you also, updating you in our group chats. Okay. Okay, see you again next time students. Don't forget to do your work, your assignments. I will be updating you in our group chats. Bye-bye. Keep safe.